This is Dolores Chadwell, my mother. We sort of watch out for each other's health, and we have over the years. She's known me for a long time. I'm going to basically just ask, Mom, have you ever seen this uh, throbbing in my neck recently or even before or any time? Just lately. Just lately. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much. At any rate, um, now I've got video footage of me from just not so long ago when I was working on airway opening devices using medical tape, pulling on skin, and in my view, pulling on skin with medical tape shouldn't tear open a suture, but maybe it has for some reason. At any rate, this is this is the recent deal. It's still going quite strong. I know they say that there's nothing abnormal except that maybe there's a congenial uh, narrowing of this carotid. However, that sounds like a pretty rare condition. Um, anyway, before when I was um, trying to open the airway, I was working from some angle over here like this and taking lots of footage of the device in question, the tape. And you can see during that period that there wasn't any any throbbing. And it wasn't, you know, very long ago, in the neighborhood of a year or so. So uh, that's more evidence that this is a recent occurrence. And I watched this scar a lot, believe me. Having a scar like this, you tend to look at it every morning. So I'm reporting this as a fresh, unexplained issue. And I think that's the main thing I'm trying to say is if it's uh, not life-threatening or my or arteries are fine or whatever. What is this? I mean, just what is it? Some logical explanation of what the hell it is because I'm not getting anything yet other than that they can't find anything other than a narrow carotid. Maybe this is part of the reason why that carotid's narrow and it isn't really genetics or I wasn't born with a narrow carotid. I don't know. I need a better explanation of what this is. It is recent. I'm trying my best to prove it to you and the before and afters that I'm providing you now should be evidence of that. Thank you.